Hi guys, I was just walking around the garden, checking things out, planning my day, noticing that I have, I think, cosmos growing around, popping up around the garden. But I've been pulling these bindweeds, wild morning glories, I guess. They're everywhere. Let's see. And I want to harvest this cilantro. It's kind of bolting. I'm going to cut it back and try to get another flush out of it. Tomatoes are growing. So excited about that. I brought the indoor plants outdoors. Well, actually, these are out all summer long and then I bring them in for the winter. You know, they're just succulents. They do pretty good out here. Okay, as you can see, I have some weeding to do here and there's cosmos growing here. I'm gonna transplant them to this area. Let me just put this down here. Harvest those. And this is a dahlia that I had put in pots. One is growing pretty good. This one, not so good. And then over here, I have the black turmeric. <laughs> uh, coming up, that's a weed. And nothing over here, so I don't know if it's rotting or rooting. Okay. Then the raised bed, to my surprise this morning, the peas snuck up on me. Look how gorgeous they are. Okay, and there's lots of them, and no matter what size they are, I am going to harvest them because the more you harvest, the more you get. And then I have another set over here, and they too. And these are the super sugar snap peas. Okay, and the onions are doing beautifully. And then the onion that popped up from my compost in this bed has escape on it. So it's gonna be a, I think it's gonna be a huge garlic. Did I say onion? Garlic. This is a garlic that was in my compost bin and apparently I put it in this bed as compost. And I got a nice garlic out of it, and it's got escape. <laughs> okay, onions are doing really good. Cabbage is doing really good. Starting to get heads. We're harvesting kale all the time. The beans are starting to really climb. And on the end here is the sunflower doing beautifully. I have a cage here in case we get a storm. We also have a large sunflower. It's going to be a large sunflower here and I'll get a cage for that. Looks like I'm going to get another harvest out of the lettuce. Though the spinach and the mustard has pretty much bolted. Here's a cabbage in this four by four bed. Getting a nice head in there. One in here, and one there. As you can see, I do cram a lot into these beds. And I love it. Beans coming up. Let's check out these garlics. Any scapes? Oh, this might be a baby scape. Oh yeah, I'm getting scapes. Okay. Okay, June, I'm gonna be making some garlic scape pesto. This bean plant is really climbing. Really getting up there. And rutabaga flowers. And we have some chard. I gotta plant more chard. Carrots are doing good. 
everything's doing good. But I am super psyched about the peas. June, I planted these so early. I gotta try a different brand, I guess, or a different type, because I want peas early in the spring. And here we are in the first week of June, and they're finally producing. Well, I hope you enjoyed that little walk around.